Stop! Stay here and patrol. Report if you see one bloody rat. I knew it. I knew it. All right. Move quick. Far across the sea, an island calls. The thing ever stays nice. It always turns bad. Things aren't always nice. You can change them. How? The way we always do. We fight. How far will you go to save the ones you love? A Plague Tale Requiem picks up a few months after the end of Innocence, right around the first days of summer. Amicia and Hugo are headed south, along with their mother Beatrice and the young alchemist Lucas, reaching places still spared by the devouring plague, the raging wars, and the rabid rats that are running rampant in the north. Is that a fair? Beneath the warm sun of 14th century Provence, the Daroons are almost able to enjoy a normal life. You're great! Yeah! But for a recurrent dream that Hugo has been having, of a mysterious island that calls him. These look like teeth. It's a two-teeth island. How come nobody noticed their disappearance? Maybe nobody cares. Maybe. One day, the macula illness that's been dormant inside Hugo awakens, and the dreaded living nightmare begins again. In the wake, Amicia finds herself with no other choice but to trust her brother's dreams and head further south towards the elusive island before he's consumed by the terrible macula affliction. The bite, yes. They've locked the arena down. They let them die here. It's starting all over again. Her mind is made up. She will find a cure in what dreams and prophecy may hold. Get used to it. With almost no one they can trust. This is your life now. Amicia and Hugo must traverse land and water as restless forces stand against them. Oh. Amicia! <gasps> you all right? After the events of last winter, Amicia is hardened, experienced, and when backed against the wall, can be surprisingly resourceful. Yes. With several new tricks up her sleeve, she is now able to freely choose between striking from the shadows or unleashing hell with a variety of equipment and tools. Hugo wants more than ever to help his big sister and not hinder their progress. We need to leave or we'll do everything. The macula within him is a double-edged sword that has deepened his connection with the rats. The rats. They can feel people's blood. Now I can too. This powerful ability can decimate entire squads of soldiers it takes a severe toll on Hugo every time he uses it. What's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> Thankfully, their journey brings not only hardship, but also unexpected friends. These colorful characters help the Daroons carry their terrible burden. It's not my first time. While offering unique skills and resources to bring them closer to their elusive goal. For Amicia and Hugo, the road ahead will test the limits of what they can endure on all levels and just how far they're willing to go. Reaching the island is only the first step to truly understanding the terrible affliction that's stricken their family as the lines between reality, fantasy, and fate dissolve. Keeping it together and finding the cure to save Hugo will be nothing short of a miracle. But Amicia has hope, and hope is the last thing lost. Others are burned in it. If you kill, be ready to be killed. No!
A Plague Tale Requiem releases October 18th on PlayStation 5, Xbox Series, PC, and Nintendo Switch.